available to be played in your SIM part in the hangar. Of course, available from electronic access. Uh, <laughs> So uh, there's just a, a quick um, go over the various different armors. So each side, there's three levels of armor. There's light armor, uh, medium, and heavy. So this is the marine light armor. And just as a note, all our character models, so we're, not, um, we're working on a new sort of modular armor system. And so we're actually doing a full rework of what the armor will be for and the, and the base models will be for the marines and the outlaws. So on the first release of FPS, you're going to get these models. but um, not that, you know, down the road, um, within a few months, we're going to be switching them out for um, the new future what Star Citizen, which is a higher level of character modeling. So right now, we sort of feel like these are OK, but they're not good enough, and they need to be better, because everything in Star Citizen has to be, you know, as good or better than anything out there. Um, so um, they're not quite there yet, is all I'm going to say. Uh, this is Delight Outlaw, um, uh, who I think is actually the weakest. Medium, uh, you have a medium marine outfit, medium outlaw, heavy marine, and the heavy outlaw is kind of <laughs> like a fat hellcast at the moment, I think. Um, and then there's a the selection of weapons that you have. I mean, you have a combustion pus pistol. Uh, this is the laser pistol, which I think you saw in the video there. Uh, the devastator, which is... Uh, Electric shotgun, which I don't think anyone's shown off or used yet, but it's pretty cool. Um, the bearing, which is what you've seen in most of the, the videos, which is the ballistic sort of submachine gun. It's a laser assault rifle, uh, which was, I think, the outlaws were using this in the demo we did in PAX Australia. This is a sniper rifle, and there's a shotgun, and a few other things. Uh, and uh, there's other th various different kinds of grenades, so frag grenade, uh, there's a sort of force propulsion grenade, which pushes everyone back. And there's the EMP grenade, which is pretty cool because it takes out all the screens and people's HUDs and sort of disables your view if you're relying on electronic stuff. Um, there's uh, various different uh, items to use, like a personal med kit to fix yourself up, personal shield, a hologram, which will dupe who you are, and a sort of, well, error denial system. OK, so 